Attention Bitcoin holders, this is just an absolute major warning. This is something that you have to watch before July 1st. And this could go down as one of my boldest calls, one of my boldest predictions ever, ever. Welcome back if you are returning. Great to see you. If you're new, do you want to have less stress, more success? Yes, you do. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell, and hit that thumbs up button. Less stress, more success. Did you hit that button? Hit that subscribe button right now. We're jumping into this chart right here. I've been studying the charts for many years, and I like to go onto a lot higher time frames to look for you know, interesting trends, things that catch my eye. And I was looking through the charts and something caught my eye in not a pleasant way. It's something that is very serious. It's something that is very powerful. And it's something that's happening inside of this box here. This is the six month chart. What does that mean? It means that each candle represents six months of price action. So a lot of folks, you know, will look at the four hour chart each candle represents only four hours of price action. Pretty boring, right? If you look at six months, then you start to see some really big picture things. The last time we made such a bold prediction was on a two month chart. Bitcoin topped out at 20,000 and for the next 903 days, it was in a downtrend. 900 days in a downtrend. And then we printed this candle, which was a dragonfly doji. Not on the four hour, not on the weekly, not on the monthly, on the two month. We made a whole video about this and we made a very bold prediction because everyone thought we were gonna continue lower. And we said, no, that's a trend reversal candle. That candle has the power to reverse that 900 day trend to go to the upside. We expect prices to reverse in a very large way to go to the upside. And you can see two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14 months later, 14 months later, what happened after that candle? That's how powerful that candle is. Now, let's get to this candle. This is the candle uh, who has the shine for this moment. And there's something that's potentially happening here that we need to make it very, very clear. Not with our emotional opinion, not doom or gloom or, or boom or bust, but just the facts and the charts without any insight of like, oh, I hope it does this or I can't wait for it to do this. No emotion just the facts on the charts. And by the way, before we really break down this candle and what we expect and what the facts in the charts are saying, I want to reference our indicator. This was really, really, uh, our community begged for this. We designed it, we custom coded it, it took a while. It has forecasts. This is a golden cross, death cross, and we're giving it away for free to our community just to celebrate our community and celebrate everyone in our community. So we're giving away for free. You can get trade alerts to your phone, to your email, warning signs, and you can use this on anything. Gold, silver, Apple, Amazon, it doesn't matter. So if you're on our email list, we're gonna email it out on Friday. If you're not, Get on our email list right now. You're just going to love it. You're going to absolutely love it. CryptoCreeUniversity.com, click right here, and you're also going to get a free course. It'll just, it'll help you tremendously. This will be your best decision ever in crypto. CryptoCreeUniversity.com, click right here. Three seconds later, you'll have it this Friday. We'll email out the indicator. Now the moment that you've been waiting for. What is this candle? Is it similar to this one? where we broke a 900 day downtrend and we just went to the moon for the next 14 months. Well, not quite. What this candle is right now is it's somewhat bearish right now. But keep in mind, this candle closes in 23 days and 13 hours, which is why you have to watch this video before July 1st. Because once this candle closes, it's July 1st. Now, what are we looking at with this candle? Well. If this candle, and again, this is going to be a very bold statement and it's going to catch a lot of people by surprise. It's probably going to make you a little bit nervous, but there is an if, okay? If, 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 make sure you hear the if because somebody in the herd is not going to hear it and they're going to go crazy. If Bitcoin closes this candle, this six month candle, if it closes, 
just below $30,000, we're in a heap of trouble. We're in big trouble. If Bitcoin closes just below 30,000, but not lower than 29.3. So just below 30,000, not lower than 29,300, we will make a Greystone Doji candle on a six month chart, which is a major trend reversal. And they're typically, by definition, these gravestone doji candles are found at the top of an uptrend and signal a major trend reversal. But there is an if. If we close just below 30,000, between 29.3 and 30,000. Devastation. When I saw this, when I'm studying the charts, I said, oh boy, I need to share this with people because if we do, I'll make another bold statement. If we do, a lot of people are saying, well, we could drop to, to 25 or 20. I don't think either are likely. I think we're going to drop directly to 14, which is the body of this candle, the body of this candle, the wick of this candle, and the wick of this candle. 14K is the most powerful level. It's not 20. It never was. And if you follow our channel for years, we've always talked about 14 and not 20. And that's because the bodies of the fan, the candles tell the facts, the wicks tell the story. So 14K is the level that we would fall directly to. If, if Bitcoin at the end of this month closes between just below 30,000 and 29.3, it's highly likely, just given the facts and the charts, that we will fall directly to 14. If Bitcoin avoids that level, we do not print a gravestone doji. There's still a lot of other things that are bullish in the market. But again, you want to look for confluence and you want to look for major market movers. For example, some candles have the power to move entire markets and some candles don't. These other candles, they don't have the power to do much, right? This is an indecision candle, right? This, this candle doesn't hold much weight. It's got a little wick, but this candle right here has the power to move, move the ocean, right? You don't want to see a powerful candle come into the market right at the top of a rally and signal a major trend reversal. We don't want that. So to avoid it, just don't have Bitcoin close below 30,000, just below. That's it. Okay, so I wanted to make this, this video really black and white, really transparent. To be honest, I don't want this to happen. Okay, but I also I don't care either way because I, according to my strategy, I'm positioned no matter what happens into the market. Uh, me and my students, we always have a very particular strategy. It's really time tested. But if you're emotionally attached to one direction or the other, you should probably remove yourself from the herd and the herd mentality. But again, this is a big if some people will take this out of context and be like, oh, my God, Steve said we're definitely going to go to 14,000 and we're probably going to do it by tomorrow. Somebody will hear this in the herd and think that. But again, let me say it for the record so that nobody's concerned or confused. If Bitcoin closes this six month candle in 23 days from now, before July 1st, and we close just below 30,000, between 30,000 and 29.3, we make a gravestone doji, which is found at the top of rallies and signals a major trend reversal. Okay, that's today's video. Again, there's some other confluence in the market that's more positive, and we're gonna look at that. We're gonna look at all of the facts and make a sound decision as a community to have less stress and more success. But this is very noteworthy material that it would be an injustice to you if I didn't bring it to your attention. You need to know the facts and the charts from all angles, and nobody's gonna be showing you the six month chart. Nobody. Nobody's gonna show you the six month chart. So I need to be the guy. Just like nobody showed you the two month chart when I showed you this. Nobody was doing it. I got bombarded with messages like, I didn't even know there was a two month chart. How do I use the two month chart? And you could see what happened 14 months later. This was the candle that had the power to move markets. We do not want this candle have the power to move markets. All right. So I'll leave you on that note. And if you want to watch another one of our videos, XRP, a realistic price prediction for this market, I'll link it here. We also did the same video for Cardano, for Ethereum, and for Dogecoin. Make sure you watch those. They'll be linked down below. Make sure you go get your uh, Golden Cross Death Cross. This will be the best decision you've ever made in crypto is to get this free 
indicator and get our free course. This will get you on your path to financial freedom and to stay more level headed and get yourself some quality, high quality education and hit that subscribe button. If you haven't done so already, hit the thumbs up button, hit the bell. I'll leave you with one last note. And this is something to improve your life. I try to do this at the end of every video. Uh, Steve's secrets to success. This one is manifest. I can't stress this enough. Uh, if you look at like, okay, what's going to provide me more success in my life? Is it the best Bitcoin strategy and to make a bunch of money? No. Manifesting is number one, right? It, you have live below your means, you have believe in yourself, and you have manifest. Those are the three things that if you do those three things, it's highly, highly, highly likely you're going to achieve substantial success. Not a little bit substantial manifesting is 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 literally feeling something that's going to happen in the future as if it already happened for example if you want to become financially free every day in the mirror you say i'm financially free i'm financially free you repeat it 10 times when you wake up and 10 times when you go to bed and guess what you're going to trick your mind into believing it's already happened. A lot of people worry about the what and the how. Oh my God, if I want to be financially free, what do I need to do? I need to do this and this and the No, 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 no. Train this. Between the lines here is the strongest thing you have in your, in your ability right now is between the lines. Manifest. Manifest it. Manifest that I am financially free. And guess what? It's going to happen. How do I know? That's how I've lived my entire life. I've manifested every freaking thing I have and everything I've ever had has been manifested. Believe it. Believe it from me. I've done it. I'm not supposed to be in this position. I manifested it and I believed it. There was no doubt in my mind when I'm a 20-year-old kid, everyone's telling me I'm not going to amount to anything. I knew where I was going and I manifested the hell out of it. Here I am, and I set my goals too low. I achieved them years ago. I set the bar too low, and everyone told me I was crazy that I set the bar too high. I manifested every piece of it, and you can too. 100% you can. Start today. I'll leave you on that note. Plenty more videos coming down the pike. Hit that subscribe button. I'll see you right back here on the next video. Peace and love to the fellow underdogs.